Today on the Clueston Cabin Build in the Fine Art of Tractor Maintenance, we're going to make a damn caboose, son. We're going to use that rail attachment, some of these things right here, weld together a caboose tray type thing, which you'll see in a couple of seconds, and make ourselves a damn mount. Because one thing that the Indra tractor doesn't come with, storage place or cup holders. And there's one thing that you're going to need if you're out there tractoring storage place for your tools and shit and a cup holder. All right, boys and girls, we got the Mahindra back. We got that caboose built. We took it over to our buddy, uh, Frenchy. He is the original backwoods barnyard engineer, if you will. So one of the secrets of living in the backwoods is you find yourself a fella or you learn all about the uh, inner workings of a welding rig. And when we're talking about backwoods welding, let me tell you about American made 100% USDA choice grade A type stuff. You want some overbuilt shit. Now this is what we got. We asked for it. This is what we want. This is what we got. Take a look at it. That there. <laughs> I wanted something light and easy. This is not light. This is not easy. This is tube ass steel. Look at that. <laughs> Probably weighs about 50 pounds. It's so damn heavy we had to have a brace attachment to it. But I can tell you one thing. It is not going any damn place. It fits our general milk crate toolbox, which holds extra drinks, gloves, Got just enough room right there to put chainsaws in or anything else that we need, ropes, line, wire. And for that upcoming fence line project, gonna use all of that. Now, we're about to go clear some more dirt. See you boys and girls on the other side. Thanks for watching, like, subscribe, describe to your friends, all the other good stuff that goes with that. Big Daddy out. Well, it works as advertised. <laughs> It'll hold anything you want as long as it fits inside that box.